Hello everyone, you are welcome back to Travel and Work Channel. A one-stop channel that brings you all the latest news, information, updates about traveling, working, studying and living abroad. Today, I'll be sharing with you, the UK's new electronic travel authorization also known as the ETA scheme. In October 2023, a new electronic travel authorization scheme will be launched. The scheme will be in many phases and will depend on individuals' nationality. The ETA scheme will be mandatory for some people visiting the UK. UK will not require a transit visa for short stays and for people who don't possess any other immigration status prior traveling. From November 2023, Qatar residents will require an ETA. Bahrain, Jordan, Kuwait, Oman, Saudi Arabia and other UAE residents will require an ETA from February 2024. More countries will be on the list in the near future. There have also been some amendments for Europe, by the 5th of October 2023. The rights for administrative reviewing for the European Union Settlement Scheme, refusals and cancellation decisions will be removed. More technical changes will affect the Appendix EU. The new appendix for children is another factor. The UK has introduced a new appendix for children and it will outline requirements for children who are applying as dependents and also for those applying independently. The aim is to provide clarity and consistency in the application process. This rule will be carried out on different dates and will be effective from 28th of September 2023. The advice I will give you as a business owner or an individual planning to apply to the UK, is to be a step ahead and update yourself regularly with evolving UK immigration processes. So, that's it for today. Thanks for watching. You want to subscribe to our channel and share our videos. See you in the next one. Bye for now.